हरिओ श्री राम अवगत ने नाथ स्वामी आय प्रजना वीरा नाईक हमारे उपासना केंद्र यो अनुभव है कि कम्स टू सेविंग दिस चिल्ड्रन देयर इज नो एडवर्सिटी नो प्रॉब्लम बिग इन अ ऑल इंपॉसिबल फॉर बापू टू सॉल्व ही हैज हेल्प्ड अस मिरेकुलसली थ्रू सो मेनी सिचुएशंस दैट वी ब्रिंगिंग अस बैक फ्रॉम द जॉस ऑफ डेथ और रिजॉल्वेबल हेल्थ इश्यूज और फाइनेंशियल और फैमिली प्रॉब्लम्स बट बापू इज मोर देन जस्ट अ प्रोटेक्टर एंड सर्वाइवर our savior he is an immense unlimitless sir ocean of love compassion and unconditional support he is omnipresent omnipotent and there's nothing in this world that he does not know wherever you be and today the experience that i am going to share reinforces this faith in the year 2008 Anirudha Purnima happened to be on the second of November, and it was being celebrated in Mulund. This day also happens to be my daughter's birthday, and we were very excited that Bapu would be coming to Mulund. And we kept telling our child that, "See, for your birthday, Bapu is going to be here. He is going to come for your birthday." I don't know what a six-year-old girl at that time. what it meant to her what she understood but we were super excited and then finally the day arrived we all lined up for babu's darshan and as we were moving along in the line everybody was uh, so excited and there was a little bit of pushing and jostling around because everybody wanted to take babu's darshan just to catch a glimpse of him and but it so happened that in all this rush it was a little intimidating and uh, suffocating for a small child my daughter started to get irritable and to a certain situation her uh, new button to three and to eight she started crying and insisting that we go back home and i didn't know how to pacify her i tried many many ways to calm her down but she would she kept on insisting that we go back home to that we leave the grounds and i kept on telling her hey don't worry child see babu is there on the stage and he will take care of you uh, he will cover your two days so don't worry we'll go ahead and uh, but but don't forget to wish babu happy birthday see he has come to wish you happy birthday so don't forget to wish him happy birthday and my child was so irritable and so peevish that she innocently asked me He, I wish him happy birthday, but will he wish me birthday? So, honestly, I had no answer to that. I just nodded my head and said, "Okay, yes, but don't you don't forget to wish him." And then we kept moving along in the line. And uh, as uh, she was uh, very small then, and um, so I carried her up in my arms so that she wouldn't uh, get trampled upon or uh, get pushed at all. And we move, we move ahead in the line, and slowly when the turn came, the uh, time came that when we were in front of Papu, uh, my daughter then she said, "Ki, mummy, uh, let me down. I'll walk from here." She said, "Fine." And then we were moving along slowly. Uh, a bhakta lady in front of us. I don't know what uh, her issue was, but. Uh, Bapu was signaling to her and uh, assuring her in his own way. He was waving and uh, blessing her, and it was going on for quite a bit of time. The line, in the meanwhile, the line kept moving, and we were not. Uh, uh, at the moment, we thought that now we will uh, have to move out, and uh, Bapu won't get time to look at us. But. Uh, how would babu let that happen and as we were moving along babu assured that but whatever her problems were he assured her and then he turned his glance his gaze upon us and we were very happy then my daughter wished him a happy birthday and you won't believe it babu went forward he was sitting on the stage he went forward and looked at my daughter she was very small so he went forward to look at her from between the bamboo railings that were dividing the lines he looked forward and 
he, his lips moved to form the words happy birthday child we were so so happy happy words fail to describe the joy but uh, it was like in the movies it happens everything was in slow motion time stood still like everyone else was just a blur only we two and babu on the stage and i looked at my daughter to see if she had uh, understood babu was wishing her to but i did not need to even ask her her face was so joyful she was so happy that there was no need to ask any question and at that moment this was it was so my daughter was so happy she just wanted to sit there and stay back but of course that was not possible we had to move forward others had were in waiting in their turn to take darshan so i told her come on child let's move on and uh, we'll go home and treat you on the aching tooth and she looked at me and said what to take her to take and also disappear it was babu's doing literally even a small wish that uh, the girl had uttered will he wish me happy birthday even that small wish babu fulfilled it that's why a dad is great even a small wish even a small uh, what do we say bal hat is also not big for him he fulfills each and every month wish so i'm going to